welcome back to Lilith's Bazaar. My name is Riley and I've been a practicing witch for about five or six years now. Um, I'm realizing in the camera, uh, I am wearing a top. <laughs> it's just strapless. Um, so today I am, I have good news and bad news. I'm gonna go with the bad news first. So the bad news is Midnight Muses is no longer sending out subscription boxes. I was very, very sad about it. So that last video was my last Midnight Muses box. Um, sorry to see them go. I really love those boxes and it's gonna be uh, weird not getting them anymore. But on the good side, one of my old favorites came back. So Magical Folk, I used to order just the Crystal Alchemy which came with just an oil and a crystal each month and I loved it. And so I figured, why not go bigger? So I ended up doing the witches, it's like a, a, a mix of combo. So I've got the crystal alchemy and the witch's trunk and it comes in the box and it doesn't really say anything. So if I just hide here, it just says magical folk, which I guess could kind of say something, but it's not like the whole box gives it away. So I already sliced it open, so I didn't have to do that on camera, but let's do the first opening. Oh, oh there's lots in here. Oh. Oh, okay. So first things first, once you take off the kind of top parts here, it looks like this. So this one, Magical Folk Monthly Ritual. It comes a little pamphlet here. It just tells you a little bit about what Magical Folk, <clears throat> Folk offers. Honestly, I love the fact that they can do mix and match combo kits because depending what you're more interested in, you can either get all three of the small ones or four of them or whatever, or you can get a big one or you can get a big and a small one. And they, just, they work really well together. And because none of them are overlapping, you're fine getting them all because you're not gonna get doubles. So yeah, and they have a kids combo as well. So there's seven different combos of things you can get to all together. I think I did yeah, so uh, monthly ritual ritual combo number six, which is a witch's trunk and crystal alchemy. And it's $31 for all of this. So this is uh, one of those boxes that is actually quite affordable. Like it, it's so good. So just the crystal alchemy, I think was like 20 bucks. Let's see here. I talked about them so much before. Oh, seven, $17. $17 for just a crystal alchemy normally. So I am, and the witch's trunk is $22. It's just, they're so affordable and they are so much better than a lot of the other kits in this price range. Things I pre gave up. If you look back in my old videos, I'm not gonna say their name, but this one is worth so much more. It's just so much more bang for your buck. Everything's handmade. And also, when you subscribe, you get access for free to their online courses. And each month it comes out with a new course, there's like a conversation in it. Like it's just, it's a community centered, it's homemade, it's a really good, really affordable, high quality kit. I don't think I can say enough good things about this company. I was so upset when the subscription kits were discontinued for a while there. And as soon as I found out they were back, I was like, boom immediately. I didn't even think twice about it. This is before I even knew about the midnight uses being canceled. So it was almost just kind of like a seamless transition between the two, but I would have had this as an extra no matter what. Now singing their praise. That was four minutes of me just going off about how much I love them, which is fine and fair and very valid. So next we have this. this looks like artwork, which I've never actually received artwork from them yet. So let's see what it looks like. Okay, so it's got two little magical folk ritual cards here. Okay, so this tells you what's in the witch's trunk. So I'm not going to look too much. I'm not gonna look closely at that till the end. And then the second one is, oh, the crystal alchemy. So the theme this month for crystal alchemy is empath. And the witch's trunk is just a curio. Okay, but I, have been very emotional recently. There has been a lot going on in my life that I'm just, I'm an empath to 
kind of the bad way I really take on and I feel a lot of what's happening around me and it sits like a rock in my gut and I'm working really hard on co learning to cope and deal with that because that's something that's on me not on the world and it's almost like it just could tell I just really needed some help recently it's just been a lot of stuff going on and I'm really really excited to take a closer look into that oh my goodness I love this artwork that is so pretty it's got like the hummingbirds the hands yin yang oh Celtic and floor leaf that's just gorgeous that is so being displayed oh I really love I actually kind of I like that it's watercolor. I'm gonna be curious to see each month how the artwork is to see who's gonna be competing for my favorite place for artwork because I like a lot of the artwork. <laughs> okay, so Magical Folk. Oh, okay, so what looks like the so Witch's Trunk is based off of Inner Balance. Once again, I think I just really needed the box this month. I really did. After this, I have a, a funeral once I'm done recording today, so I might be a little not as huge today. So I apologize for that, but I really like this. Okay, so on to the box. I'm going to save this for afterwards because I don't want to see it just yet. And then like that. So this will be the Crystal Alchemy, which this is all it used to be too. So I'll save the witch's trunk, whatever, for afterwards. Okay. So first and foremost, the crystal. And looking at it as the light's coming through it, I think it might be a smoky quartz. So it is quite dark but it's like an earthy brown so that's that's really nice I like that It'd be really good in a candle and then we have the oil and this one's called empath and inside so the ingredients are hawthorn clove and gardenia it's a ritual perfume reiki char reiki charged hedge witch crafted so there let's see if I can that's really nice bottles. Okay. Oh, it's a roll on. Oh. Oh, I like that. That's going on for today. I haven't put on perfume yet for later, so. I know. I kind of put it in weird spots, but. I don't like putting it too close up here because I think it's really greasy. So I like that's a roll on. And it's not like two roll ons because I feel like this is better. So now, before I go into the witch's trunk portion of this, let's find the here. So this, I also like how it's like a crow. It's really nice. Oh, by the way, they're from Fresno, California. So they are an American box. Empath, uh, the natural perfume. Oh, it's a tumbled Apache tear. Oh, that might be why it's so dark. Oh. It's like it does look black but maybe it's holding up to the light confused me nice okay so this <laughs> might be why i loved it so much it's a gemini altar print so the duality two sides i like that and then there's a gemini online workshop so then it gives you your access code um and in this just gives you i'm just gonna cover this so no one else sees but it gives you your access code so that you can access the free online courses and if you just want to do the courses and you don't want the boxes they totally um you can just purchase the online course they're really good like really good i thoroughly enjoy them i think they have a couple of them for free if you want to try it out before you subscribe and do stuff like that so okay i'm just like rolling it uh, about the crystal alchemy kit you are not only a reflection of the energy within you but the energy around you this thoughtfully curated crystal alchemy kit wards energy that can weigh down your vibration and jeopardize your inner balance soothing as it strengthens the resonance locked within this seasonal crystal kit facilitates the expression of emotions whether to be released or honored serving your highest good around the clock 
Wear the Empath Protection Oil and carry your Apache Tear throughout the day to nourish your emotional health and ward energy that would detract from it. Place the crystals nearby dressed in oil as you sleep in it as you sleep to transmute heavy emotions during the night, enabling you to wake up fully renewed. So tumble the patchy tears, create a grounding foundation for exploring, expressing, and releasing your emotions. Offering protection to safely explore your inner world, Apache tears are a stone of awareness, perception, and self-acceptance. The Empath Protection Oil fosters healing by ch channeling wisdom and peace. Black tourmaline and blue lace agate optimize um, emotional health by protecting you against negativity and promoting emotional stability. So that's the two that are in there at the bottom. <sighs> okay. Um, further facilitating the balanced flow of emotional energy, the inclusion of cloves purifies noisy energy, heightening receptivity to spiritual messages amplified by Hawthorne. Um, finishing, finish with gardenia oil to raise your vibration and promote love and contentment. The protection oil is the embodiment of emotional healing. So that's really great there. So I'm going to be taking this with me today for sure. I just, I really do like, this is all I used to get and it was probably one of my favorite kits and I just love it. So good. Okay, so now this is the witch's trunk. So they come in the one box because, but they're two separate kits, right? So they're not gonna be, you can tell I didn't open this because I gotta figure out how to open this sticker. One sec. Back. Trusty knife. I hear something jingle jangling in there. Whoa, what is that? So open it up and it's got stuff inside of it. But first things first, what the heck is this? Okay, so there's like a little perfume bottle almost, but it's sealed. That's cool. And then this, it's like a shell, but it's like a hollow bottom. That's so cool. Oh, I love the color. Like a soft pink. This is for sure going to be going on my Aphrodite altar. I've got, I moved her over here a little bit for now. Everything's kind of in disarray. You can see on the back here, all my crystals are kind of just chilling. I've been reorganizing and stress. Okay, and then yeah, this little tiny bottle is the cutest thing ever. It's so tiny. Love that. Okay. Ooh. Okay, so this is, it looks like a candle, but it is wax for like seals. So you melt it and you can seal your bottles. You can seal, do wax like the press seals. I got a couple of those, that's nice. And I don't have a pink one, so that's really perfect for self-love spells. Okay, and then it's got three jars in here. So let's pull this one out. Ancestral Spirit Salt, looks like it's got some nice lavender in there, some salt, pink Himalayan salt, definitely lavender in there. Okay, so ancestral spirit, salt, and then we've got, oh, oh, I thought it was empty, but it's not. It's a butterfly wing. Like, if you can see that kind of, it's not gonna focus, but oh my goodness. That's the actual, just butterfly wing. Okay, <laughs> didn't expect that. And then hex breaker on crossing salt. Ooh, that's good. I have been slacking on making my uncrossing oils and salts. Oh, that's so good. And it's black salt with maybe coriander in there. These are good sizes. It's just a nice big little jar, like big jars. Okay, so that's what we had in there. Uh, that butterfly wing's a weird one. So yeah, I'll just go through it. So it's the Butterfly Wing Curio, uh, Hex Breaker and Ancestral Spirit Curio and Ritual, Ritual Salt Set. Ooh. That's 
exciting. Okay. Um, and then you have the sea urchin shell. Oh, sea urchin shell. I did not know sea urchins looked like this. Hmm, it's very pink for what I thought it, it was, but that's really cool. I really like that. And then, oh, okay. So this is spirit doll heart curio. It's an amber oil. I don't, I'm going to look in to see what that kind of is while I'm in here. Glass vial of fossilized amber and labdanum oil. Oh, okay. So it's fossilized amber? That's cool. Okay. Spirit dolls and medicine bags reconnect us to ancestral magic and medicine. Shielding against malevolence, the blend channels the highest good of the ancestors. Using the amalgam at the heart when crafting a spirit doll invokes the ancestors' love and strength. So I guess wearing it, keeping it close to your heart while you're making things can be protected. I need to look into this because that's really cool. I did not realize that amber could be like liquid like this. That's really cool. Okay. That's fun. That's really fun. See? It's fun things. And then the wax sealing stick. And then it comes with the Gemini print and um, so usually I, I'm gonna, like I'm gonna guess the print comes with the like box on the whole the combo kit on the whole so it's not getting doubles of everything because it comes with the workshop so that's awesome hex breaker and uncrossing salt ancestral spirit salt covered by uh, mercury Gemini Sun enriches communication along the physical realm and beyond so this um, ancestral spirit salt is a blend of sea salt, black lava salt, and red sea salt. And then it's got mugwort, lavender, and wormwood. Okay. This is really good. Okay. I am a huge fan of mixing mugwort and wormwood together and lavender and things for other activities. And then this butterfly wing is really cool. So it's a, viewed as a symbol of transformation corresponding to both fire and air. Uh, they represent the progressive wings of change. And they're said to be the messengers between the world of living and the afterlife, humanity to the divine, and from the physical to spiritual realms. So this butterfly wing will allow your t soul to fly. That's really cool. Well, I thoroughly enjoyed that. And then that last thing. So inner balance ritual. So this is a whole ritual, tells you what you need to do. Breathe deeply, focus on the sound of your breath. Find yourself in a hallway. At the end, there is a door. So that's a good one. Maybe I'll make a short video doing the spell and I will practice it and learn it so I can just read it out to you and mesmerize you and you'll just fall in love and find inner peace and balance. Boom. I'm uh, looking forward to reading that. I might really just need this after a little bit here. But that is everything. So we've got two ritual salts, a butterfly wing. We've got a sea urchin shell, some really cool liquefied amber. We've got wax. We've got an Apache tear and an empath oil and artwork. I uh, dropped that. Oh, yeah, okay. And some artwork and a ritual. Really good. And everything's handmade. My like, my favorite companies are the ones that spend the time to like make it handmade because I just find so much more thought goes into it. And as much as I loved Midnight Muses, it was a little produced, but I loved them because it was still really cool items. Whereas the rest of my boxes tend to all be pretty hand hand crafted, which is the way to do it. But that's it for today. I am off and I hope you enjoyed this video. Please remember to like the video, subscribe to my channel, ring that little bell so that you're notified every time I post a new video. Um, and leave a comment down below if uh, you are also a fellow empath and how you deal with it. That would be... Uh, nice to get some tips. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a blessed day. Bye.